Hello, this is Breuer, and welcome back to another episode of our Let's Play for Motorsport Manager. We're finishing up our fifth season uh, of the challenge so far. We've got one race left to go in 24 days. Uh, I think we'll be able to get all of our parts um, performance up by then. We shall see. But yeah, uh, I think things got a little bit better this season. Obviously, we're still last place as a team, you know, from the driving set standpoint. But I feel like we made some progress on the driver, on, on, the, on the cars themselves, I should say. And of course, on like some of our staff and things like that. So, and our marketability is amazing right now. We're making so much money off of that, which is just great. Um, we'll take the interview. Why not? Sure. Chu is doesn't have a lot of growth, but you know he's not a bad driver. Pit crew review. Hard fought battle. Let's go check out the pit crew. Can we get any more new awesome people? Oh my goodness, you are so good. Just terrible. Excuse me, sorry. Um, like, what can we get that gives us better stamina? I mean, you're going to be good for refueling, so I think we're going to grab you for sure. But the rest of these, unfortunately, just are not. I mean, the 85s are pretty good. I think if you were 85, I might seriously consider grabbing you, but 70 is just so bad. So we're going to go reject and reject. We're definitely getting better people with our better um, staff guys, or our better... Um, Mechanics, but uh, still, man, that was rough. And we just need some really good solid people. 18, actually. 18 refueling once you add in all the extra stuff that we get with it. That is pretty solid. Uh, in fact, we're going to swap you around now, I believe. Um, I mean, you're burnt out, but we can potentially still use you. But yeah, we're going to bring this 18 in. Why not? Pop you in there. Uh, we definitely need to swap out a couple of these yellows. So we need some better tires. Actually, there's a 13 tire right there. Swap you in. Another tire down here, maybe. There's an 11 or a 12. We'll take the 12, I guess. And the next highest is what? 1.7 on our fixing right here. Um, doesn't really matter, but we'll just grab you. And then 1.3 up there. You know what? We're going to use you. Just because you're burning out anyway, we'll just use you while we can. 1.4 over here on fuel. We'll grab this 0.4 and plug you in there. I think that's about as good as it's going to get. Still got that 1.6, but everything else is about as low as it's going to be. Yep, I like it. Let's go with it. And um, let's go check out our car. Oh, we're still preparing. There's the car repairs. Hey, we're getting some new sponsors coming up. That's awesome. So, yeah, we're going to get this done three days before. Perfect. That And that's even going to get done. So, now this is all very, very good. The best parts are going to get improved across everything. Yes, this is good. Now, let's check out our sponsors here. We do have some good sponsors here available. Three of them available. It looks like Viking is probably going to be the one we want. Two mil up front. None of these other ones really matter. It's $500,000 per race, basically. That is amazing. I love this marketability. This is great. Absolutely incredible. 93.7, five stars. Just, just awesome. Perez is a little bit low right now, but, you know, it is what it is. Um, I doubt any new drivers have popped up that we just don't know yet. Nope. We're still, still is what it is. Hopefully some new ones pop up next season. Publicity opportunity. Um, add personality trait publicity pawn which isn't great does give us a little bit of money and gives us more voting power sure I bet that lowers some of her stats but honestly I'm okay with that especially for a little bit of money unless it lowers her marketability which would be unfortunate it increases her marketability lowers her morale oh, this is, that's great um, we are literally at 99%. This is, that's pretty insane. So do we have five stars everywhere? We have five stars everywhere. That presumably still puts us only second. How can we be second on sponsors with literally the best we can get? How actually we're third on staff? Pit crew is not too bad. It's really just the car and the drivers at the moment, which somehow I feel like that might be the most important thing in a weird way because, you know, car does have to get across the line and it has to have a driver to do it so 
probably good for us to bring those up a little bit at some point. But we're getting there. World Motorsport Championship. Real. Come on, guys. Let's uh, get this stuff done. We're actually going to get this other staff center done as well, right? So that's going to be good. Problem found with ECU. That's no good. Team's championship. We're good. That's fine. All good. I don't know if this is going to carry over or not. I'm worried that this does. So I'm kind of willing to just drop the five. I don't know. I, I honestly don't know if it carries over, if anything from the chassis carries over at all. I'm worried that it does. And so without knowing, it's only 500,000. We just got the 500,000 for the other thing, the publicity opportunity. I'm going to go ahead and say yes, just in case. I don't think it does, but I, it's worth 500,000 to me to, to make sure. Um, homeworks were complete. Factory staff idle. Like, are they just idle, idle? They are completely idle. I mean, there's literally no reason to do anything else at this point. Yeah, let's just say reliability, because why not? Focus pure on reliability. Um, tiny bit better, but I'll probably forget to swap you back, so we'll just do this. Um, although, actually, you're going to swap over to the reliability probably next season anyway, the beginning. We'll, we'll, we'll try to remember that. Like, I don't really care about this, but just figured I'd do something. Uh, and I don't even care about the performance stuff. What was I going to do? Oh, I was going to check this. Anything? Hey, we're up to 8th. Yes, that is awesome. Still 10th. Up to 8th. Oh, that's good. That's really good. I mean, we're still in that bottom quadrant, most likely. Maybe. But we're, we're, we've got some good foundation to go into next season to hopefully boost up a little bit more than that. Um, did we get... Surely we didn't get anything that's purple, did we? No, still just green. Um, but still, that's a good start, I think. Good start. All right, uh, yeah, just grab whatever. That's all good. Uh, that's fine. Let's just get through this race. I'm excited for the off season, quite frankly. And I, I might put some good money into my, my chassis. We'll have to see. I can try to make some intelligent chassis decisions. Definitely want to get better tire wear. I mean, our tire wear is just so bad. It rain a little bit on at least practice day. I forgot to check to see what it was for race day, but... I don't know if it really matters. Last race of the season. I mean, I hope we get last place. That's that's my goal, right? <laughs> that was a joke, obviously. Because <laughs> it's like, hope we can get 19th and 20th. I mean, come on, team. Go, team. Oh, she's 17th right now. Come on, Greaves. What are you doing? I think we can be the ninth place team next season. I do. I just, maybe more than that. I don't know. That might be asking too much, but I think we can be le greater than 10th, which is awesome. Just starting that transition off the bottom is a huge deal. Because being on the bottom, you don't know how far off the bottom you are. You know, you don't know how far into the bottom, you know, I should say. But once you start getting just above the bottom, you know that you're, you are starting to make some improvements. And so I, I would be really ecstatic if we got that. Um, uh, wait, is it going to rain at all? Nope. So we will just take, I don't know, take that and that, it's fine. I don't know if it matters. I'll take that. Actually, I'm impressed that we're actually starting to get some of the mechanic stuff up already. That is a really good sign. Wow. Yeah, we'll use that, please. But we will drop down force just a smidge to get down to there. And then tire choice. No, we're just going to do pure on mediums the entire time. Please and thank you. And yeah, we'll go max fuel. That's fine. And then you... I guess this one's a little bit better. Although speed balance. Lucky just a smidge more. And same thing with you, right? Yeah. You might be able to make it. We'll just stick with the mediums. All is going to be well. We really just need to get through this race. It's all that matters. Uh, 
Go team go. Good season, guys. I mean, a couple signs of life here and there. So honestly, overall, I'm relatively happy with, with some of the things that we saw this season. All right, we're going to go high, 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 high. I'll figure out the feeling stuff here in a minute. I'll just go down medium, medium. It doesn't really matter. How warm is it? Oh, it's really warm. I have to go down to conserve on the tires, please, and thank you. Alright, we're going to start pushing piers a little bit more with the engine at the least. Just to see if we can separate them just a smidge. Alright, you have three in a little bit, so that's going to be fine. You have three in a little bit more. But I think yellow is going to keep you, get you to the fourth. So I think this is okay. Getting close on the tires, though. We might not have it on the tires, unfortunately. I think we can barely go one more lap by by much, though. And medium, fill up just a little bit less. It's all good, but uh, we'll go fast. Uh, we'll drop you down to yellow, just give you a little bit more cushion. Probably gonna drop you down low just to make sure you have enough to go that extra lap. Yeah, that's gonna be fine. Uh, medium, fill up. Oh, uh, that's good, that's good. Yeah, that's gonna be okay. Uh, we'll go high and neutral for now. And same thing, high and neutral. Go, go, go. Hey, at least we're not dead last again. <laughs> I mean, I don't know if that, if that really says that much, but it's a thing. Oh, under investigation. Oh, no action. Good. No rain. Just going to be clean and easy. Just settle in, guys. Uh, we'll go down to conserve, man. Heat in these tires is crazy. Let's check when we cross the line here. Oh, three in a bit, so that's going to be okay. And then four in a bit. Probably need to come down to yellow just for at least a lap, and then we can go back up to orange maybe. Yeah, we can go on high back, back on high now. All right, go ahead and pit you. Um, probably eight laps remaining. Probably can do them on softs, actually. Eight and a bit. It's all good. That's all good. Uh, we will drop you down to yellow. Just to hopefully give you a little bit extra cushion there. That time the tires was a little bit better. Just above the 30% mark or so. All right. Pitch you... Uh, and I guess seven left remaining. Yeah, I guess we can do you softs. Why not? Um, so seven in a bit. And I think you can stay on the orange and be fine. All right, so I'm going to go high and neutral for a bit. And high and neutral for a bit. We did get a mistake that time, but um, and it did cost us some of the time that we got made up for with the passer pits. But honestly, it's fine. I mean, getting one mistake every once in a while is not a big deal. I mean, we're only a couple seconds off of 17th. We're a long ways off of 16th, though. 
We still got a lot to go, to be fair. We got a lot to go. Got some really good suspensions for next year, though. It is suspension, right? Yeah, that's the one that was, like, pretty high up there. Even our gears. Like, we got a couple risky gearboxes for next year as well. I think we're going to be good. I'm hoping. Yeah, I think we put, like I said, I'm going to invest a little bit more into the, um, the chassis. I mean, I know we need to, um, I need to save up for some of the other, like the factory and stuff like that, the, uh, car factory, whatever. But, um, we're just going to have to, we, we're going to have to get that through like sponsors and things like that and really just do the best we can with the parts for right now. Hey, we jumped up a little bit. Oh no, that's the time penalty. Never mind. I thought they said there wasn't going to be a penalty. I guess they changed their mind. But even that still wasn't enough to drop us out, which is kind of funny. All right. Season's in the book. Starting to make a little bit of traction. Can't really see it very well uh, on the results, obviously. But you can see it on the um, kind of where our car parts are starting to creep up there just a smidge. I think she's trying to get a little bit more boost here, which is pretty awesome. Two and a half million bucks for just for losing. I can't say I'm I'm upset with that by any stretch. That's why I'm like, we can definitely get us another driver. Um and be fine with that. Alright, let's go and do the off season and then we'll uh we'll put a cut in there after that. So yep, that's that, that's that. We'll take the interview, why not? We we'll have to say she needs to button it, unfortunately. Don't want to drop anything else. Pit crew had a little bit of a mistake. Let's check out our pit crew real quick. I love that 18, that's so amazing. Um, there's a hundred. I like the hundreds, please and thank you. Uh, let's actually say so we want the hundred and we want the 96. And we probably want that 96. I'm gonna reject you, as good as you are. I'm gonna reject you. Uh, we're going to reject you. So I need to get rid of three people to be able to pick up these. Uh, okay, so we're obviously going to get rid of you. And then... 92, 96, 99, 86. Yeah, the 86 needs to go. And the 85 up here needs to go. You only have one race left anyway, but that's okay. And there's 86 as well. And then we're gonna go hire all three of you guys. That cost us 600,000 bucks, but I think it's worth it. Cause you guys are gonna be awesome. Yeah, 15s, that's really good. Cool. I'm happy with this, I think. Uh, let me just do a real quick pass through here. Make sure. And you know what? I'm going to renew everybody just to make it so it's done. So it maxes it back out to 12 races, which is good. I mean, maybe there's a negative to doing this. I don't know that there is. And it's possible some of these guys we might want to replace next season as well anyway, but I think it's worth it because it doesn't seem like it costs us anything. So that's part of the reason why I'm okay with doing this now. Let's get everybody on the same page. Everybody on 12 races. Cool. That works. All right. Um, let's go. I don't think there's anything for us to do between now and the end. We've done everything we can do here. I love that this is finally starting to get up into the green. That is awesome. Because that's the average right there. And we're just short of the average. I mean, there's a little bit further. Obviously, we don't care about the engine. We're making progress. This is may not feel like it just yet. But I think we're definitely making progress. Twelve and a half million bucks. Uh, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Um... The chairman's retiring. Aww. Bye, Bjorn. Need to get us another mentor. 
not a cheap inventory. Preferably one that's a pay driver. Spec engines, real safety car, remove bonus points from pole position. So a lot of changes actually. Chariot has been promoted into the world stuff. Uh, Thorns dropped down, and then Silva has been promoted to from the European, and Ozu's come back down. Okay. Actually, I don't think we've seen Ozu yet. Um, so does that mean we already have? Yeah, I was going to say we already have someone who's just somebody. Uh, let's go real quick. Let's see if we can find us just anybody to just nothing. It's pay driver and possibly mentor. Or I'd probably settle for just mentor, honestly. Pay driver mentor. You're 36. You are actually relatively expensive. He's interested. I mean, I love the mentor thing. He's also got pretty good feedback. Honestly, he might be all right as a backup. He does want his his status, his status is fairly important, really. I mean, he does have a lot of potential, to be fair. So I don't think I want him. I want somebody who's got like no potential, which sounds really bad. Uh, what is team player? Oh yeah, yeah. So it's just happinesses and things. Nope. Pay driver, nope. You have potential, which I don't want. Not for this role, at least. Uh, I can't see your things, pal. You are a pay driver. Really prefer a mentor. Come on. Give me a good mentor. There's a mentor. Not a pay driver. He probably doesn't want to be. Yeah, it's fine. Now we're starting to get into some like actual halfway decent people. That's the part of the problem. Yeah. Well. Oh well. Didn't we have one? What was the one up here that we had that was a mentor? Was it you? No. And you're a pay driver. I guess it was just this Jesus guy. I mean, we can try. There's no way. I mean, even a hundred thousand bucks is probably silly. We'll try for him. I mean, I would rather really like you to be the reserve driver. I know you're going to hate it. I mean, I'm willing to give you max money because I think we can get that money back. Basically, you'd be a wash. We're really just basically getting nothing off of you just for that. Um, we'll go with this. I will pay for your 500000 for that just to get that. Yeah, sure, why not? Give you a little bit of sign-on bonus. It's a lot of money to put for a reserve driver, but, you know, why not? Let's try for it. Worst comes worse, we could also get a different driver and just put Pires as a reserve, just as a pay driver, but she won't have the mentor, which is unfortunate. Um, Nelly. Nothing here. Oh, we got some sponsors coming up, which is going to be helpful. Our preseason start. Good stuff. A little bit of a save. All right, let's get into this. Come on, guys. Um, car design elected. Yes, I know. I would love to get sponsor stuff before that happens. Hey, there's football manager. A million up front. But there's the possibility of getting one more. So I'll hold off on that. But we will come over here. And we'll design our next car. Okay. A little bit of money, not a lot. Man, we're about 30, 30 mil, which is not bad. Okay, so. I want. I mean, this does give us a little bit of stat modifier, but we're going to have spec engines, so never mind. So that's, not, that's not worth anything. So this would give us a little bit more fuel efficiency. So 
one's a weak, weak. This one's a weak, very weak. I kind of want the more improvability, honestly. So I think I'm going to go with this. Um, I really want good tire wear. I mean, this is an expensive car, but and it's probably crazy to do this, but why not? I mean, we're going to go for it. We're going to go for it. we got a lot of money. we got some really good sponsors. Let's go for it. Let's just give this all our all. Our all. It may not matter if we can, unless we can get to the next star. I actually don't know. Well, let's go with this. Why not? See what we can do. If with this we don't really do all that well, then we'll know. You know, that that's it's information for us. He actually likes it. And he actually doesn't mind being the reserve driver, really. I mean, he's expensive, but as long as we always use him for uh, practice, then he'll pay for himself. I mean, maybe not counting the cost of brick contract, to be fair, but I think he will, I think even that he'll still just barely maybe make up. And I think really it's just we're paying a little bit, we're basically paying 600,000 bucks for a mentor, which I think is okay. So yeah, get rid of Mr. Ackley here. Bit expensive, but I think it's okay. And he's, again, he's a reserve driver, which he seems to be okay with. He's actually got some potential, which is funny. He's actually got good feedback too, which means when we use him for the pay driver part, it's going to be okay. Um, I do want to check here real quick to make sure there's no new drivers. I don't know when they pop in. Oh, there's a bunch. That's awesome. I uh, don't no, wait. Um, cancel that for a second. I want to grab the guys who are not currently under contract. And then we'll go for some of these other ones that are under contract. Yes, please give me a good, an amazing driver. I want somebody amazing. Great at Staff Center. Excuse me, sorry about that. Um, that's fine, oh, that's good. Let me scout anybody yet. Uh, oh, this is good. Yep. Oh, we got another sponsor. Yes, perfect. Uh, a mill for four races is 250000 per race. I mean, this one, there's a chance we could get 10th or above. There's a chance, right? I mean, in theory, I think it's low likelihood, but... I don't think this is, this is not, we need the guarantee. We'll take the mill. We'll take the mill. Uh, do I want to work on anything else for the HQ right now? Kind of the next thing I want to do for my HQ is honestly, I don't need the rear wing. I mean, I can upgrade one of these things. Can't do the factories or the design center right now. Um, or something like the gearbox or Get us up to the epics levels. Actually, that probably wouldn't be bad. Start working on some of those. So maybe the suspension, the gearbox, and what's the other thing that we need? I mean, I would love to get that. Front wing, there's brakes. A little bit better brakes, actually would be better. Let's do that. Because that at least gets us up to great on those. And I think that would be useful. I mean, technically, I probably have enough money to do something else, but then we're really low on what we can do for starting working on parts right away. So I think I have to hold off. I mean, I could basically do a part per race, more or less, but I think this 8 mil is going to have to just sit there. I mean, I'd love to do the telemetry center, but it still leaves 2.7 mil, which is probably enough to do something, and then we'll start getting some money from the races themselves. But no, we're going to go. We're going to leave that there just to make sure we can really hit the ground running with some parts right at the beginning. All right, we're getting some contracts. Uh, did we get some scoutings done? No, apparently not. Did I mess up the scouting? Media puppet. A lot of marketability. Oh, yeah. The better, better improvability. I think this is great. 
Unless this is just engine. I don't think it is. I think this is just overall improvability, right? Let's go for it. We need that improvability. Um, do we not finish any scoutings? Uh, we got some coming up in a few days. Okay, so we're getting there. We're getting there. Oh, there's even a few more. New ones. Hello. Thank you. Please. Ah, good stuff. Come on, give me some good ones. Alright, there's a couple of scouts. Right, stop, stop, stop. Pause. I want to check these guys out. Uh, volunteering. Hey, even more marketability. Alright, come on. Low quality driver. Boo. One of the weakest drivers. Boo. It's already been snatched up by somebody already, which is interesting. One of the weakest drivers. Uh, mercenary, eh, hothead, got more marketability, refocus, which is only short term, got a lot of potential to be fair, but no, marketability is too low, I need to keep the marketability high, alright, let's check these out, uh, one of the weakest, one of the weakest, I don't care about being one of the weakest, as long as they, it's got great marketability, how are you already snatched up? That is insane. Definitely not. That is crazy that some of these guys are already snatched up. Um, yeah, like this Mark, this guy right here, a lot of potential. He still might be worth picking up, but I'm really hoping some of these other ones pop through. I was really hoping with our special, you know, scouting center that we get some things other people just don't see, but I guess they probably have good scouting centers too, to be fair. Low quality, just no. Come on, give me a good wonder kid, please. We need passion. Nope. I mean, he's great, pretty good driver, but no thank you. Want to buy wonder kid. Our simulations. Oh, come on, give me something good here. Oh, let's go karting. Uh, fairly decent driver. I mean, he's got some potential. He's a pay driver. Terrible corning. What is up with that, buddy? It's chasing. Great. Um, but no, so no, that's not going to work for us. Yes, better tire wear is hugely beneficial for us. I mean, there's a lot of money to spend on this type of thing, but tire wear is a big deal. We've really not found anybody else that we really want. I mean, that Mark Bustos guy is the one that's jumping out at me the most. He's just got no fitness, which is weird. I mean, in theory, that would start scaling up, but he might be somebody we can look at. All right, there's a couple more real quick. Let's just check these guys out. I mean, no. Come on, give me somebody. I want a wonder kid. I mean, not bad. Terrible marketability, though. Uh, did the Bustos guy, I forget. What was his marketability again? Oh, he's a perfect 100. I'm tempted to grab him. He's going to have terrible on a lot of things, good on some other things, and then he's going to start growing. He's 19 years old, so he's going to start scaling up pretty quickly. Really need to get that fitness up, but uh, thankfully that's only got four more weeks, then he'll go back up by five, which is going to be a pretty big deal. Although that does lower his marketability back down to maybe 75%, which may not be good. Hmm. But even 75%, we're still going to should still be able to get five star people. It's very tempting to pick him up instead of me and Malin. Very tempting. Would he even be interested? Let's just cover ourselves a little bit here. He is interested. He's got so much potential. And I don't think, were there any other guys that we can, we're scouting right now that, and I've been scouting quite a few people, but anybody else that's not currently taken? 
Oh, no, we're on Scorn's County 3 people. I'm sorry. I was looking at that wrong. Let's go let these finish and then we'll see. Here's our livery. Uh, we'll go up to. See, that was last. Last one was number. This is number five. This is, so this is six seasons. So we're going to do number five. Ooh, I like that. That's really cool. That's pretty cool. I mean, it's pretty dark, but it's got a little bit of highlight. I kind of like that. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Come on. I really just want a solid and amazing Wonder Kid, but it's very unlikely. Look at this. Two and a half stars. Two, this is really good. Fuel efficiency is a little bit lower, but improvability and tire wear. Come on. Those have to be good for us this season. And there's a scouting driver. Uh, average. He has potential, but his marketability is pretty low. Eleven days, seventeen hours. Okay, I'm about to get you. Mr. Roland here. Please be good, Mr. Roland. You're seventeen years old. I mean, a couple of those things look pretty solid. 11 to 16, 12 to 18, 10 to 14. A couple of them are pretty low, but I'm hoping that means he's got some growth ahead of him. One of the best. Oh, it would not be one of the best. Sorry. I misread that. Um, will not take team orders. Ugh. Got good marketability though. He's not taken. Low smoothness. It's only 17. He's gonna be able to go up to a fourth. He actually probably pretty good. And I don't know if we have to worry about the team orders thing. I mean, I can just completely ignore that. Just be happy with his marketability here. Even if it goes away in 11 weeks, it's still gonna be at least a 90. Do we wait for this last guy? 10 days. Pauline. I think we could offer to this and then still see Pauline, right? In theory, I think we could still offer him. All right, let's see what here. Better, even more tire heating. What? Oh, this is tire heating. I'm sorry. I was thinking it's tire wear. Uh, I don't know that we want the tire heating because I think we can handle the. I, I think I'm pretty good at handling tire heating for the most part. So, no, we're going to say too expensive on that one. I want this guy. I do. We get the preseason testing and the new design before we get the scouting on this other guy. Here's what I'll do: I'll probably go to this date and then offer him a contract, and then see if we can get to that scout before we have to decide on something. So yeah, let's go ahead and do this. Let's go ahead and offer him a contract. And status isn't too important. We are going to make you. That means we're getting rid of Miss Perez here, which is so awesome. But no, we're going to go ahead and grab you. And we're going to make you, for now, we're going to say you're the number two driver. We'll have to see how we want to do stuff. Um, of course, that goofed on me. Can I cancel and then come back? Yeah, okay. I don't know why it does that. All right, we'll say number two, just because we've already got a number one. Um, but we might renegotiate her to be equal status later. They aren't very important to you. That's weird. He has no patience, though. Like, what's the highest we can go? 564. I mean, I feel like i got to give you something good. And then long contract, I'm definitely okay with that. Since it's not very important, but I'm going to give you this one on bonus anyway. Hopefully make you happy. Maybe something like that. Eh, we'll do something around there. Bonus size is important. I will definitely give you the maximum bonus I can give you because why not? If you happen to get first place, by all means. If I can eat for 260, that would be pretty solid. All right, let's do the preseason testing. Oh, come on, be something good. Not bad. I mean, as it is right now, 
top half average. I will take that. And that that bodes pretty well. Cost me a lot of money. But oh my goodness, if we can start scaling up and kind of go up the stuff now. That would be pretty amazing. Went brilliantly. So our designers are ready to get cracking. Oh, I am so tempted to grab this. But what if we don't get it? Then we're fired and we're just out of it. It's only three mil. I, we're going to make that up just from, you know, uh, some of the other stuff. I'd rather go 10th and then surprise myself then go eighth and then just be failing and then just be miserable and lose marketability. So we're going to go 10th. It's less money, I know, but until I can prove myself that we can get above 10th, we're going to go with that. All right, we got... Okay, we can start working on the card and stuff, right? Is that what that said? Um, definitely want to improve parts. And we are going to swap you over for now. Slight improvement. Not much, but something. And then... Um, don't care about the engines, spec parts now, which is really helpful. How are we looking over here, by the way? Eighth, ninth, seventh. Yes, that's huge. We're not the last place car. That's really, really good. Uh, okay. Um, what is going to be critical for this one? Top speed, obviously, acceleration and high speed corners. So let's go with the gearbox. That's also does take a while to improve anyway. So I think that is smart. Um, I don't see we'll just plug in the three things that are not 80, I guess, for now. Um, yeah, that's going to be okay, I think. We'll at least get some improvement on all of them. And then we'll also just plug those in to get some trickle performance. Please and thank you. But yeah, we definitely want to design a new part right away. Which probably means that whatever part we're going to design... We could drop off of here, but let's just at least get something on here for the first race. And the thing we're lowest on is brakes. Which, you know, you're not bad on it. Actually, you are growing up. It does look like you are going up pretty well. Um, I mean, it's not amazing, but it's a start. 353 from base, 8 from designer, 10 from components. Uh, does the base come from this? Yeah, it goes from this, I guess this best part maybe. So, I mean, this is not amazing, but it's about, what, 18 points better? Is what it comes down to. And then we'll have, oh, 40 to max. That's awesome. So we'll have some other options later. Actually, it's even better than that because it's, it's 353 plus... More than 18, right? Because it's 371, then it goes up to 392 to the map. Okay, yeah, no, that's even better than that. No, this is good. I like it. Let's build this part, please, and thank you. It's actually going to be done before the race is done, ready, but I don't think we're going to put the reliability into it, although it does get a little bit of a booster of reliability. All right. All that is good. We'll worry about bidding parts later. Let's go. I want to get to the scouting driver real quick. Please be somebody amazing. Wait, did they not finish? Oh, it didn't finish. A uh, bit of chance of rain there. Low quality, decent amount of potential. Nope, not good enough. I am so sorry. But that other guy could be pretty good. When's his contract negotiation come up? Here in a couple of days. About to finish the break. Um, so designing brakes are finished and improve parts and I mean I definitely want to move you, you off of there I mean we might get a little bit here tempted to drop off some of these I mean I'd really like to get these up to 70% though but 65 is better than nothing Let's go up, drop the ones that are above 65. Actually, we'll just drop off all the ones that are above 60. See if we can get this thing up a little bit and go from there. Uh, we are going to design a new part. We're going to go for another break. We're going to go and do that, I guess. And then we're going to do an extra five days, but 
an interesting part. <laughs> but, um, oh man, look at that. Another plus. This is going to be really good. We're going to be able to get an amazing part here. In fact, we might be able to put that. Yeah, I think we might be able to get some really, really awesome breaks here. Good stuff. That is going to be helpful. It's going to be very, very helpful. Yep, still ninth, so getting that above seventh, I think, or higher would be pretty awesome. This looks good, really. Um, I mean, it's going to be twice the expense of what we're paying right now, even more than that, because we're not going to get rid of the paid driver, but he's a really good driver. He's got a lot of good skills. It's going to help with him. Markability's going to be fine. He's not going to take team orders. I have to take that into account. But I think that's going to be okay. I, I very rarely use team orders anyway. He's going, to, he's going to continue to advance pretty well. No, I think I like this. He's a bargain for a three-star almost. All right, let's actually do this. Let's uh, compare him with... Um, Greaves, for example. I mean, more braking, more cornering, a lot more cornering. Basic same smoothness, a little bit less overtaking, which means if since he doesn't, he hates team orders and he wants her to overtake, well, her overtaking is going to help her do that if she needs to get past him. Consistency is pretty bad, but adaptability is amazing. He's going to be good in the wet weather and stuff like that. Fitness is about identical. Feedback's not great, but our reserve driver will help us with feedback anyway and focus is great. He's an amazing driver. All right. Um, yes. Please and thank you. And I'm sorry, Miss Perez. Really sorry. But it's time for you to go. It costs us a decent amount of money to break her contract, but it is what it is. I like you, Perez, but this is what it is. I'm sorry. I really am. We need we need we need to get better. We just need to get better. Um. Oh, can we request additional funds? No, a little early. Okay. All right. Here's our ready for our first race of the season. Um. Let's check out the cars real quick. Actually, let's go. Yeah, let's check out the cars real quick. How do we do on improving? Eighty five. That's awesome. So. We're going to give you, you're the number one driver for now. If he starts showing up and being better, then it is what it is. I mean, he's, he is a better driver than her, but uh, I'll go ahead and give her the best parts for now. Um, just, to, just to say, because she is listed as the number one. We may renegotiate later. Uh, so you're going to get that one. And you're going to get this one. Those don't matter. Those don't matter. You're going to get that one. You get this one. Those don't matter. And you get that one. So you're content. And you are content as well. So both of y'all are content at the moment, which is better than what we had last season. 99% um, is amazing. All right, well, we're going to go ahead and put a cut in there. When we come back, first race of the season to really see if we have a chance to do anything with this season. So, yeah, that is what it is. Uh, I'm excited. I'm ready to see what's going to happen. So I do appreciate you guys watching. May God bless you, and I hope you join me again next time. Thank you and goodbye.